Hi friends, welcome to Technical Widget channel. Today in this video, we will see how to use nearby sharing option to share the files in Windows 10. That is nearby sharing option is inbuilt option in the Windows 10. Nearby sharing is an Microsoft answer to the Apple's airdrop. It got introduced in Windows 10 in April 2018 update. This feature lets you share documents and photos, web links and many more from your computer to a nearby computer if both have a Windows 10 wirelessly using Bluetooth or Wi-Fi. Now you can share photos and videos directly from one computer to another computer all thanks to nearby sharing. And what's even better, it is super easy to use this feature in Windows 10. Then we'll see what is the feature. Nearby sharing must be enabled on both computers, that is the receiver as well as the sender. Before you can transfer files, also both these computers must be running Windows 10 version 1803 or above. For nearby sharing to work, you can enable it in Windows 10 by following the sum of the steps. That is, first open the settings and click on the system tile. In that, shared experiences. On the left turn on nearby sharing. You can disable this nearby sharing anytime by turning this option off. So how to configure nearby sharing? You can choose to share and receive the content to and from all the nearby devices or only among your devices. Moreover, you can opt to save the incoming files in a custom location. That said, you can configure these settings also through this settings. By opening the settings, then click on the system, then shared experiences. Under the nearby sharing section, I can share or receive content from. Select one of the two options, everyone nearby or my device only, based on your preference for the shareable devices. Okay. Next, you can click on the change button under the option save files I receive to. That is, whatever the files you are receiving, those files are to be saved in some of the folders that folders you have to assign it that is to choose a new location to save the incoming files finally now browse to the new location and click on select the folders and from then on the incoming files will be stored in the new saved location then how to transfer the data and media files after enabling nearby sharing on both the computer, it is possible to transfer files from a configured device to any other using the Windows 10 share. Once you are ready to transfer file, then we have to follow these steps. First, we have to open a file explorer, right click on the file that we wanted to share. That after right clicking, choose share. You will see the share dialog with the list of shareable devices. Here you select the one you want to share the file with and your file will be sent. Next, you must choose one of accept or decline the transfer on the destination or receiver device. Please note that it will time out in case of no response and the source device will not be able to send the file. After that, select the save and open or save when the notification appears on the device. You are sharing to and the file will be get saved in the set locations. Troubleshooting the nearby sharing. If you are unable to work with nearby sharing, you can find some of the few troubleshooting steps that I wanted to tell you. First of all, please ensure that you are running the Windows 10 version 1803 or above on all the computers. Then please check the some of the troubleshooting tricks. First one, suppose if you are not able to transfer files using nearby sharing. The answer will be nearby sharing requires Bluetooth or Wi-Fi to detect a computer or devices in range to transfer files. You must ensure Bluetooth and Wi-Fi are on and working. If you still can't transfer, you may need to install or update the drivers bar Bluetooth and Wi-Fi using any preferred option on your devices. Nearby sharing works with Bluetooth version 4.0 or later. 
with support for low energy that is le you can check this settings after this devices here bluetooth and other devices then click on the more bluetooth options switch to hardware click properties switch to advanced it shall have lmp 6.x or more then some of the transfers are very slow using nearby sharing for this if you notice that file transfer is very slow it may happen that the device is transferring the file over bluetooth you must ensure the devices are connected to the same wireless network and the network is using private networking profile for enabling this private networking profile open the settings open network and internet click on wi-fi click the wireless connection then select private under network profile okay I hope this video along with these troubleshooting tips and tricks will help you to work with nearby sharing on Windows 10 and you will be able to share files speedily without using any third party tools. I hope this video is very helpful for sharing some of the files and medias. Subscribe to this channel for getting more technical information like this. Thank you.